Live, man. Norfolk VA, man. Straight like that. Coming off uh, one of the greatest performances I've seen in a long time. <laughs> this guy, I fucking, I hate him. <laughs> you, you just put a stop to Mike P's momentum. You know. Um, like nobody's business. It's tough, man. It, it was tough, man. Mike P, definitely. Salute to Mike P, man. He's definitely something special, man. He, like, for future opponents for him, y'all got a problem on y'all hands. Mm. Definitely. So, uh, you had performance of the night at... Uh, the last PG event that I was at and um, you know everybody was like oh Mike P Haitian that's the battle to watch all of a sudden from out of nowhere kind of from out of nowhere you and Nun Nun uh, had battle of the night you in my estimation uh, clearly won that battle um, and so this was the one that people were looking forward to because Mike P beat Haitian um, so it was kind of the two winners uh, facing off um, and I kept telling Mike P you're gonna lose. He's gonna he's gonna three zero you. And he was like, Nah, nah. I got an angle in the third. Don't worry. Um, you know, going into the battle, what do you think about uh, him as an opponent? Man, I know with Mike P, he, it's nobody you can sleep on. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know he punches. He got wordplay. He's entertaining. Like, it, it's it's tough. He was one of one of the toughest dudes I ever faced. Definitely because mm -hmm. you know you never know what you're gonna get from Mike P. So going into the shit, like, you know, had to make sure that I had. A, First round, had that, that, you know, mm. that first round from the last event, I had tried to give three of those, you know what I'm saying? That was in my mind because I knew if I slip, he's going to kill Yeah, because that's just what he do. Uh, now, uh, this is your second PG this year, but you had a PG. You've had, set, what, how many PGs have you had? Because you and Genocide Yeah, battle. me and Genocide was the first one. That was some yeah. crazy shit. Like, yeah. shout out to Genocide, too. Mm. And then I battled Riggs. Like, I wouldn't, you know what I'm saying, that was that was before the Nun Nun joint, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I ain't never know, like, this one, you know, it was some noise was like, yo, you want to do, you know what I'm saying, this PG, you know what I'm saying, the last one for the year. So, I was like, fuck it, let's wrap the year up, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'll take Mike P and let's get it, mm -hmm. you know? So, I was going to sit out this car, but nah. it is what it is. Uh, so, on Twitter today, we were, there was like, we were quoting stuff, and people were going crazy, and everybody's retweeting. Um, the dude next to me is like, keep tweeting, keep tweeting! Um... <laughs> And I asked at the end of the battle, like, what, you know, what, because people are saying you're ready for the main stage, maybe not uh, the top of the Summer Madness card, no, but, no, um, so you know, against process. a sophomore, against a, a vet, um, you know, which which guys w do you think you'd match up well with? Sophomore? I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't have no list, man. Like, I don't sit and, I don't sit and think about who I want to battle, man. It's just whoever they tell me they got for me. We can set it up. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some of the names that did come up, um, I think I suggested Briz Rossi, and I thought it'd be a good energy That's matchup. Um, uh, people were suggesting be magic I'll with that, that punch to punch. Yeah, uh, I, I, so. yeah that's, that's, that's something I like. That's, that's, it's about pen testing, man. Like, mm. Anybody like Mike P, he's going to make you test your pen. Like, opponents like that, that's what I want to do because mm. the object is to progress and get better. So, yeah, be magic. Mm. That'll be tough. Uh, What's up, man? Mike P's third round was very much attacking not just you, but the style that uh, that you do very well, which is that punchlining without much personality, really. Um, personality? I think it's like you're not – well, I, I, I think you're – I'm not an asshole. I guess I gotta be an asshole now. So fuck this interview. Nah, yeah, yeah, there we go. No, no, no. But Yo. Av breaks battlerap.com camera in the interview. That's, that'll do a million views right there. Yeah. No, no, no. But it's, it's third round. It's all facts, though. Like yeah. it's, it's all facts, man. But I'm, I'm gonna change that shit too. You know okay. what I'm saying? So, you know, it's it's interesting to see. You know, a guy like I was there for Danny Myers versus Rum Nitty all those years ago. It's a, a similar feel to this battle where um, there's there's the excitement as you're building with. Uh, uh, line after line that is react that people are reacting to, but there's also the excitement in the second, like in the second half of the first round, where people are starting to realize like this is the classic that we were hoping for, um, and that kind of like builds with it. So um, I don't know, that wasn't a question. I was just saying congratulations, it was awesome. Um, and in 2016, you got anything coming up? Um, just music, man. Just you know, just music. See whatever they line up for me as far as opponents. Hopefully, we can get this rookie sophomore, or rookie vets, or whatever. I'm, I'm with it all, man. I, I love war. I love war in a good way, right when it comes to rapping, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm a good, you know, civilian. What's it like in, uh, you're from Virginia, right? Norfolk. Norfolk. Yeah, Norfolk, Virginia, yeah. <clears throat> you and Big K is a nice little style uh, matchup, too. Yeah, shout out to K, he's doing his numbers, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah, he's he doing his numbers. You know him? Yeah. I, mean, I don't, you know, I know, I know right. familiar. Yeah. Good guy. You know. Get out of here, Jeffrey. Uh, Get out of here. We're done. Battlerap.com, we're at. <laughs>